Hello and welcome to another video tutorial from ComputerGaga.com. In this tutorial, we want to look at how to compare two lists and highlight the missing records from one of them lists. So on the spreadsheet in front of me, our scenario is that we have a list of members, a huge list of members, and there are two more members in this list as there are to the list on the members two sheet at the bottom here. You can see there's 21 rows worth, 20 records, and there's 19 rows or 18 records on this list. There are two missing members. The idea is that these lists are huge. We would like to compare them both and use conditional formatting to highlight the records that have to be missing on the other sheet. So let's get straight into it. The first topic, the first task of the day really is to select the records that you wish to format. So I'm going to select the whole list because I'd like to format the whole row to highlight the whole row. And I'm going to go into the conditional formatting tool on the home tab and go straight for new rule. Our plan is to use a formula. We want to use the VLOOKUP function uh, to, to look for each member using that unique ID in column A on the other sheet and if it cannot find it it will report that and conditional formatting will apply some formatting. So, new rule. Use a formula to determine which cells to format. And we're going to write the function equals VLOOKUP. We're going to ask it to look for the first member ID. But I'm just going to take the dollar sign away from the two so that it will quite happily check the other members of this list. So effectively I'm asking there to, to check all the members in column A. Comma. Where are the members that you'd like to check? They are on that other sheet. Members 2. Check all of them. Well actually I'll just get it to check that first column. There's no need to look at the whole range although that would work as well. Comma 1. Check it first. Check Check it to return whatever's in the first column. That's only looking at one column, but we still have to put that information in. It's a mandatory argument. Comma false. So it's going to look for an exact match. We're checking a member number. It has to be that exact number or nothing else. Closing bracket. Now at the moment, that VLOOKUP is going to run, and if it finds it, it will return the member number. If not, it will return the hash and a error message. What we want to do is, if it doesn't find find it, then it is a missing item, it's a missing record uh, and we would like to format it as so. So VLOOKUP will return hash and a if it cannot find it. I'm now going to add the isNA function at the beginning there and wrap it around the VLOOKUP so that when the VLOOKUP reports the error message isNA will display the answer of true. Yes there is a message i.e. Yes, it is true that member is not on the other list. So now we can click the format button below. Trying to click it. Oh dear. Here we go. Fill tab. Let's have an orangey colour. Fill lock an orangey colour and click OK. And it finds two records, a Liam Dacian and Holly Smith, who do not feature on that list. Fantastic. Hope you enjoyed this tutorial. So that was using the VLOOKUP function within conditional format with the isNA to compare two lists and to highlight the missing records in one of them lists. Thank you for watching. Please check out some other tips and tricks at computergaga.com.